If I would have got 10 euros for any time that someone told me you were right, I don't say I would be rich, but I would have probably saved up a little nest egg. I'm saying that because sometimes clients become stubborn and they don't want to listen. And that's strange because if you're talking with a plumber, with a dentist, with your mechanic, and uh, is giving you advice about something, how it must be done or anything, probably you would listen to him. But strangely enough, many times you don't want to listen to your tattoo artist. I understand that probably is be just because uh, tattoos are something visual and uh, maybe you focus on a little detail and uh, you think, no, I don't want that little detail in my, in my tattoo. And you lose the whole picture, maybe that little detail. And maybe <laughs> your tattoo artist is giving you a lot, a lot of uh, different options and you don't like any of them. Probably because the first one was good. It's not said that sometimes a client can, can give you an inspiration and think, oh fuck, I never thought about that. that that's a cool idea, of course. But anyway, sometimes when a, a client becomes stubborn, of course a tattoo artist cannot insist too much. Uh, we cannot uh, tie you on the chair and say, and now you get this because I think that is better. Of course not. But it's really sad when you go back to your tattoo artist saying, oh, I think you were right. Because if you, if you go to, I don't know, when I was doing comics and maybe an art director was coming to me and say, oh, yeah, maybe you were right. Your idea was better than mine. Well, it's not a, it's not a big problem. I can take my drawing and redo that as I, as I did it before. I can change something, but a tattoo cannot be changed. When it's done, it's done. So I suggest you to listen to your tattoo artist because most of the time, if you choose the right artist, of course, many of the time is right. He spent his entire life drawing, creating tattoos, looking at other tattoos, looking at art. And so he developed a aesthetic sense, an aesthetic taste, and he developed his talent. So is able to visualize, to, see, to already see if something can be good, can be wrong, and how it will say on your body, how eventually can be extended. So really, when you th talk with your tattoo artist, think about that, he's a professional. He's doing this job for a long time. He took this kind of choices every day for probably tens of years uh, for an entire life and uh, you never did so trust him of course if you choose the right one.